Alright, hello and welcome to a special Fallout 4 video. You guys probably won't see it for a while, but I mentioned in a Shadow game that'll probably come out in four days. Probably. I only recorded it today, so and I, then I built the thing I said I was going to do. Basically, as you can probably tell by the tower, by the title, I have built something that I am quite happy with. It took me a while, a couple hours, kinda. But, in the video I said I went to a place and I said I was going to build a kind of Zerg inspired building. And this is it. I call it the Starlight Spire. Because it's here at the Starlight Drive-In. This took me quite a bit of time to build and a fuck ton of resources. So many resources. But I built it, and I like it. These are the stats it has at the moment. It's only got two people. It's going to take a while for it to get in there. I've moved all of my resources over. All my extra weapons, my food, my additional armor and power armor. So, let's walk in through the only way in. The front door, heavily guarded by heavy laser weaponry. You walk in this door uninvited and you're gonna get blasted. Eventually I'll probably give this guy a shotgun and I hope he doesn't waste the ammo on it. For some reason my fans are not spinning. I don't know why, they have power obviously, but they don't feel like spinning. My water from that which was once irradiated now totally clean providing vast amounts of water. And if you come out this way, you'll find my artillery platform currently unused, and my shops currently unattended. They will be, eventually. We'll proceed to the next level, just some simple beds, some generators that power the entire facility, and another view of my water and food as you can see all strewn around the center there I like I like the mutt fruit it's good it's easy it's simple we'll proceed to the next level the uh, living quarters as you can tell all the beds that you may need people can simply sleep wherever they need to and then to the next level I kinda ran out of um, the ability to build because I can't build anymore so I've got four workstations here when I have more people people will work here this was originally where I was gonna put my shops but the roof is too low and it wouldn't let me and then we come to my floor this penthouse I guess you could call it from which I can look out upon the world my crafting stations my armor my weapons and my chemistry as you can see my weapons are stored here and then my armor is stored. Then over here we have all my food and drink. My power armor, my Brotherhood of Steel power armor, and my XO1 power armor. This is the armor of choice of course. Then we got my bobblehead collection, my data log, data and sh all these stupid card things, all the magazines I've collected and stuff. Nice little sentry bot toy and my computer. From which I do pretty much one thing as well as load hollow tapes. I also can control the turrets from here of which I have five. So that's kinda cool. I got the radio broadcasting here as well as my primary pylon that connects my nice windmills so yeah whenever I feel like going and exploring I just jump in my power armor and then just jump off the roof this is a nice place and I said I was gonna build here and I damn well did it's just as I envisioned yes the key part is the fact that the water is right here and that's what it's built around I hope you enjoy this and I hope you inspire it inspires you guys to build something of equal badassery. It's not as epic as others have been, but it's 
It's pretty cool. I like it. You know? I like it. Yeah? So uh, hopefully I can get more bloody settlers here. That'd be nice. Having to sit on two for a long time is going to suck. But yeah! Again, hope you've enjoyed. Later! I'm just going to go back to my rooftop. If only I could sprint, but I can't. It takes a while to get up here, but I've also got a fast travel mat. So whenever I fast travel, this is where I'll be. Um, this one's over here, simply because it can then just run out. Maybe I should put the mat over there instead. Let's do that. Let's do the mat. Put it there instead, so then I can spawn here, and then the first thing I see is my power armor, and my terminal. From with which I could... I wish you could write notes in the terminal, like keep a log. There's probably a mod for that. But that'd be pretty cool, like you've got a terminal, if only you could write logs and notes on it. I think that'd be pretty cool. Too bad you can't. Makes me a little sad. So yeah, hope you want to enjoy and like it. I certainly like it. This is probably the biggest thing I've ever built and it took a fuck ton of resources to do it. Yeah. Later.